time for a quick pickups video. First up is Choplifter for the Atari 7800 um, Pro System. I bought this from an online auction site in Belgium. It was 5 euros. It looks extremely scruffy, but it's hard to come by uh, Atari 78000 games. So I'm happy with this one. Didn't have this one yet. Then today I went to my uh, favorite thrift store. I got Harry Potter and the Deadly Hallows Part 1 for my girlfriend. It's the special 2 disc edition. Uh, we just recently saw the, all the movies. I have 1 through 6 on DVD. So I only need uh, Part 7, seven and yeah, Part 8. But it's also Part 2 of 7. So for a euro and a half you can't uh, really complain about that. Then I also got Highlander 5. Who knew there was a fifth movie in the Highlander series? I sure didn't. It's with Paul, uh, Adrian Paul, the original actor, not from the movies, but from the TV series. The fourth movie was already extremely dodgy, so I guess <laughs> this one be, will be as well. Then they also had a stack of sealed Max Payne 3 games. Promotional copy, not for resale. But you know, to find a sealed game at a thrift store for a euro and a half, even if it's just Max Payne, I don't care. I bought it. I don't even have a 360 yet. But then, for more pièce de la résistance, Power Strike 2 for the Game Gear. This is a game I've been looking for for a very long time. I love all compiled shooters. So, Power Strike 2, I certainly had to have it. Sorry, I have a bit of a cold. Um, well, let's start it up. See what you guys can see. Probably not much. I'm gonna try to do this. Yay! Alright. This is actually a not. This uh, Game Gear has not been recapped. I have another one that has been recapped, but the graphics on that one look actually worse than this one. So, this is a very rare game. I paid 25 euros for it, loose, which is not super cheap, but on eBay it goes for around 50 or so. So, I guess you know, I'm <laughs> gonna die a lot here playing with one hand. Uh, I will do it. But you can see it's an awesome looking shooter for the Game Gear. 